Hello, welcome to the Ideas. Today I'm going to show you a slime video and glibbery video. As you can see, this looks amazing. And I've basically used shower gel for this. And um, you can kind of pull it slightly, as you can see. And um, it's very slippery and slimy. It feels really nice. And um, it's easy to make. And uh, it smells really nice like rose. So I've used this uh, shower cream or shower gel for this. And it smells really good. Uh, it also makes it slightly pinkish because of the color of the, uh, of the shower gel. Right, what we need is a big bowl where we can mix everything in. And um, we've got a measuring spoon here. This is, um, yeah, this side you can also use just a normal spoon. We have coconut oil, uh, corn flour, and the douche gel, or the, the shower gel. And it's like a cream with rose flavor, rose smell. And um, it's slightly pink, it's very cute. And um, yeah, I'm confident that our slimy mess will smell like rose, which I'm really curious about. We'll start with our cornstarch and measuring uh, seven spoons of the corn flour in here. Six, seven, let's make another one, eight, nine, and ten. So we'll do ten spoons in there. You can, um, you don't have to put ten spoons in there. You can do half, you can do quarter. Um, just keep an eye on the measurements, that's all. Um, so a spoon of coconut oil. You can also use rapeseed oil, sunflower oil, olive oil, it's a bit expensive, but you can use that as well. Uh, right, mix that all up. That's all mixed, so it's still very, very dry, so we need to add the rest of our ingredients, which is the shower gel. Oh, I've added another spoon of coconut oil before we add the shower gel. And we're creating it a bit crumbly. So I think I'm going to add one spoon of the shower gel. And if I need more, then I'll need more. All right, I'm keeping it. I've added a little bit more of the shower gel, more than one spoon. As you can see, it depends how much it sticks, how, you know, if it's still too, if it's too wet, then you can add a bit more corn flour. It's too, if it's too dry, you can add a bit more coconut oil or shampoo. It's, um, it's, it's that simple, essentially. And at the moment, I've got this nice um, yeah, nice substance. It feels amazing, and it, hold, it all holds. It smells really nice like rose, which I'm really happy about. And um, I, need, I still need to wash my hands, as you can see, it's everywhere. But um, yeah, I'm satisfied with the result, and it feels amazing. See, you can also kind of stretch it like that. It can break, or it can be slowly. It's a really nice substance, it feels great. And um, it's kind of like a stress slum as well. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it feels good and it's fun. And um, yeah, if you find it uh, interesting as well, then please um, subscribe to the channel. As you can see, I've washed my hands now and um, I just wanted to check that if I still mold with this, um, would it, would my hands get dirty? Well, they are not, which is good. So I can take a little bit with me. If I want to take a piece with me, I can put it in a little top like this. And then you can take it with you. That simple, then you don't get any dust or any crumbles of stuff mixed through it. We have a um, very small pot here, and we have potty in there, like a, some kind of slime. 
Here I've got, I've, I've washed them all out and um, it has two parts in this top. And I can add some in there. Very handy. You can take it for on the way and um, it will still stay uh, this consistency or this, yeah, this thickness. And uh, yeah, this is handy. You can you can take it in a big tub if you'd like, because it's quite a lot that we've made. And um, yeah, it would stay soft for a while, which is good. And um, yeah, you can also add washing up liquid instead of the shower gel. That's also possible. I hope you enjoyed our video. If you did, then please subscribe to our channel down below for free. And always be the first one to be informed about new videos. Um, we have loads more videos for you, so I'd say have a look on our channel. If you have any questions or comments, you can write them down below and we're happy to answer and reply to them. Also, if you have any ideas for us or anything that you'd like us to make, then you can write them down below and we're always very interested. We can uh, basically help us help you, which will be a good idea. Yeah, stay posted on our channel. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed our video and hopefully we'll see you soon. The next time, I do why it is. Have a good day. Bye.